Now, if we think about uh, the conformation of RNA double strand, so when we uh, talk about this kind of strands where we can find the double uh, strand interaction of RNA in between RNAs, then we can find the interaction. So, what kind of RNA is going to make? What kind of direction this uh, this helix is to uh, is going to propagate uh, when the two strands are coming together to make a double helical RNA? Now, according to the presence of, uh, as uh, there is a presence of the two hydroxyl group, two prime hydroxyl group in the ribose sugar, it is conformationally flexible region of an RNA molecule. And, and as we know, uh, the presence of these two hydroxyl molecule in RNA prevents this RNA double helix to, be f to, be ma to maintain the B form. So instead of maintaining the B form, it helps or it triggers this RNA duplex to form the A form of the RNA to be the A form or to make an A form of the RNA. Okay, so what do you mean by this A form? Uh, as you can know, uh, this A form is slightly bit more zipped than the B form and it is al also uh, very, very, it is not stretched, it is zipped and uh, minor groups and uh, major, minor groups are narrow and deep. Uh, minor groups are, sorry, not narrow, minor groups are deep and major groups are narrow in this case. So it is making the A form stable because of the presence of the hydroxyl, 2' hydroxyl group in uh, mm, the ribose sugar.